Hi, I'm Tom Daves with eXp Realty, and today I'm going to bring you a market update. As many of you may know, the market is really hot, and some of the reasons behind that is because here in the local Sacramento area, we're seeing a lot of Bay Area buyers moving this direction, and many of them are millennial Bay Area buyers. And when I think of millennials, I think of investment portfolio if they're diversified. But to be honest with you, the millennials have a lot of money, a lot of cash, and they're moving up this direction because they want to move out of the Bay Area since the pandemic. They want little space, they want multi-generational, they want an office. So we're actually at a one of my beautiful million dollar listings right now. It's a $1.4 million listing and these are the types of properties that the Bay Area buyers are purchasing and they're buying them all cash. We're seeing multiple offers and we're seeing bidding wars. So let's kind of jump into some of the stats here. If you'll see on this first chart, this is the inventory chart. And as you can see right now, currently the inventory is about half of what it was at this time a year ago. There are 1,926 homes for sale in the greater Sacramento area. And you'll see the closings were at 2,613. So the inventory is extremely low. And some of the reasons are as follows. Number one is since the pandemic came, a lot of people have taken their home off of the market. Another reason the inventory is so low is because the low interest rates, they're two and a quarter and 2.75%. They're extremely low and the buyer activity is high. Plus the new construction is really low. So there's a lot of reasons for the low inventory. This next chart you will see is the average price per square foot and it has gone up consistently month over month. Now it's $266 per square foot on average in the greater Sacramento area. And we are seeing values going up at the rate of about 1% per month. So values just continue to go up, which is great. Now the next chart is the percentage of list price to closing ratio. And you can see that the homes are selling on average of 100% of the list price and they're selling in only 27 days. And so because the homes are selling in 27 days, what that means is it's historically low days on market. People are selling their home in a very short amount of time. And the last chart is the month's worth of inventory. We're only seeing 0.7 months worth of inventory. And if you'll remember, Anything under three months is a seller's market, so it's definitely a seller's market. Four and five is a neutral market, and anything over five is a buyer's market. So we're seeing um, historically low interest rates, historically low inventory, buyer activity is at historic high, and again, a lot of that gets back to the Bay Area buyers, the millennial buyers, and also a lot of the Baby boomer sellers are moving out of state. And if you remember the baby boomers, you know, originally, I think of, you know, the minivan, I think of the Beatles, I think of Jimi Hendrix. Uh, the baby boomers are, are moving out of state to other areas, Idaho, Nevada, Texas, Arizona. So there is the market update. Thanks for joining us. If you have any questions, give me a call. 916-296-5841 or you can go to my website tomdaves.com thank you and have a great day